with the release of his first two albums, Oxygen and Equinox, in the late 1970s, French electronic music pioneer Jean-Michel Jarre proved that synthesizer music could sell millions of records. Jarre was not only the first musician from the field of electronic music who had mainstream success, he also staged record-breaking concerts that attracted audiences by the millions. In Paris, in the front of the Pyramids of Giza, or in China, where Jarre was welcomed as the first pop star of the West to perform there, Jean-Michel Jarre never stopped producing music for the masses. Especially the last decade saw the composer non-stop bustling, Jarre not only released two albums of collaborations with famous electronic musicians, such as Primal Scream's Bobby Gillespie, Yellow's Dieter Meyer, and the late Ege Frusa, Tangerine Dream, he also released Equinox Infinity, the second part of Equinox, four decades after the release of the original album. So the first video I chose is from uh, a French band, a young French band called The Blaze, and uh, with the album called Territory. And, uh, I choose them because, uh, you know, I always considered that uh, electronic music has a legacy, has a, is a family and also has a future. And uh, this band is quite interesting and I feel quite close, even if their music is totally different than mine, because of the fact that they are doing more or less everything, including their, their videos. So they are filmmakers as well as musicians. And uh, it's... Uh, the way I see the future of electronic music by, I mean, almost merging what, I mean, visuals with music. I mean, it's, we are using the same tools these days uh, in the digital world. And I think this is a perfect example of what could be done in the future.